In today's video, we are going to install a third brake light up here on the top for better visibility. All right, we're going to try to make the housing for the light out of this piece of aluminum. I went ahead and cut a piece of cardboard to use as a template. Alright, here's our template that we're going to try to make. So we're going to transfer it over to the piece of aluminum, cut it out, bend it, and we'll see how it looks. We got the ends riveted together, and we got the hole for the wire drill. So now we're going to put the light in the hole, mark where the mounting screws go, make sure these marks are right. Then we'll put in some rib nuts and screw it in. got it built and drilled, sanded it a little bit. We're going to use my favorite paint to paint it black so it matches the rest of the trailer. Now we'll just give this an hour or so to dry. And then we'll be able to put in the rib nuts attach the brake light, and then we can hook it to the trailer. Okay, now that the paint is dry, I'm going to install these rib nuts into the holes. Then we'll screw the brake light into the housing, and then we'll mount it onto the trailer. Here's the assembly I'll put together. Looks pretty good. So now we need to bring it up here. We have to drill a hole through for the wiring. And then we're gonna tape, probably rivet, 
this piece to this top trim piece. So let's get going on that. Okay, now we're gonna go ahead and mount this to top of the trailer. To do this, I added a couple strips of VHB. So we just have to find the middle point, drill a hole for this grommet as far down as we can because we don't want to hit the metal frame. Then we'll run the wire through and tape it in place. All right, there you have it. Third brake light is installed. Now we just have to wire it up on the inside and it'll be much safer because the regular brake lights are pretty low.